I don't care about good appearances right now, so apologize for the cracking voice. And I quilted well do shit right now. Um, hey guys, I am on official, have been an official sick day all day. Um, I'm daring to look at the clock. It's 2.56. I barely slept. I tried. There were times that NyQuil was starting to affect me and then I just snapped my eyes awake. There's a chance I might take some NyQuil later today. Um, yeah. I think it's just a stress, stress cold, I guess. Um, versus the dehydration that I have right now. That's causing my voice to crack like this. And, uh, the bodily aches, which is the reason why I'm in bed. Um, the heaviness I feel on my, on my head, and the stiffness in my body, and the tightness in my chest. I didn't know what else to do. I didn't think it was a cold cold, I think it's just stress. From all of a sudden the financial aid problem, to, uh... I do school. Stage, sage, maybe. One of them is sage is moving. Me trying to get a job. And then, I don't know what else. Those are kind of the only stress factors I have right now. And I think I just had some anxiety moments later that also added to the buildup. And then all of a sudden, a, uh, a, apparently a member in the family killed herself in her closet, and we're kind of waiting on the autopsy. She was very young, but I hardly ever knew her, so I'm not sure exactly what to say. Um, I think death is literally just a transcendence into another world, into another state of mind. And probably a state of consciousness. That it is not the end. And I always had these things that I'm not exactly afraid of it. So, yeah. Um, so really we're going to be, me and the family are going to go, hopefully, assumingly, uh, some here in September. We're going to drive all the way to Colorado, which is a very long drive. I'm not even sure how they're all supposed to do it. I'm half tempted to just stay here, but I feel like I should go. I just need a no date so I can let my teachers know. But other than that, I still feel sick. I still feel horribly, horribly sick. And the dream didn't help. I woke up at 5.02 this morning from an intensely vivid, strong dream. I still remember a good chunk of it, surprisingly. And it just disturbed me a little bit. I'm not sure why. Why the fuck did I have to have a dream of growing three dicks? I just, that doesn't make any sense. And why does it have to be an action figure? And why does it have to be a fucking toy? And why does it have to be me going through growth spurt after growth spurt, only getting taller and taller and taller? And then plus adding the demon-like factor and the fact that it literally drained me when I woke up, so... Yeah. I hate getting these stress sicknesses. They... Literally wear me out mentally and physically, more or less physically. Just wanted to catch you guys up on that. Um, hope you're all having a nice day. Bye.